The fact that we suspend, the National Executive Council suspended our strike does not mean it is uru uru yet. Because IPs still remains a serious challenge to our system. Members of the Colleges of Education Academic Staff Union, Kuasu in Ogun State, have called on the state government to put an end to untold hardship being faced by members of the union in respect of salary arrears and non-payment of promotion allowances, among others. While addressing journalists at the Ogun State Governor's Office in Abiyokuta, the state capital, the National Vice President of the Union, Ulusha Gunlano urged the government to promptly pay the third party deductions deducted from salaries. Third party deductions rightfully deducted from our salaries in federal colleges are still being withheld by high peace. This is not satisfactory. If you have paid net salaries, why are you withholding the third party deductions? It is immoral, illegal, and highly criminal for any employer to pay net salaries and withhold third party deductions. So we are warning the federal government and the Office of the Accountant General of the Federation to please do something urgently on this issue without further delay because it may threaten the uh, peace that we just brokered with the federal government. The government was also urged to attend to all pending issues with the belief that the directives given by Governor Dako Abiodun will be carried out by appropriate agencies of government. I also want to appeal to him that he gave us hope yesterday and that all he said he should fulfill. He actually told us that he doesn't make promises that he will not be able to fulfill. And so we believe in what he has told us and we are looking forward to the implementation. We also want to appeal to him that he should ensure that the government officials that he has given instruction to yesterday, that they adhere to these instructions very well. This new resolution was sequel to the suspended planned protest by the association. From Abiyukuta, Jumoke Adebari, reporting for Captain Television News.